Lovely, thank you very much. Start as we mean to go on. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Thank you for joining me today. We've got some exciting upgrades on the Marin today. We're gonna try out the new Hope Force 30 wheels here at Bedgeby Forest. It's a lovely cold frosty morning. We're gonna head out to trail. Also, add a little bonus. I've got Wayne the Viking with me as well. Nice, so he can keep me on track. So yeah, we're gonna go try out these wheels. See how it is, have a little pedal round. Let's go, go. Right, so as always at Bedgebury, Genesis first. Bit of Phil Collins. Didn't go to plan either. Can't put the weight on. All right, be dad's army. Yeah, it's, uh, this one's good if I remember rightly. Oh, dirty inside. It is marbly, isn't it? This bit's good though. Woo! Yeah! Wow! <laughs> Big slip. Smoother than me. Oh, I've got, I've got an aggressor on the back. So I've got these. Yeah. I'm a. I'm double wasser guy. Yeah. So this is the black run. It's nothing much really. If you're an accomplished rider, it's fine. I think it's, this, it's one of these corners, I think it's this one, come out into a drop, yeah. Whoa, that's horrible. That needs clearing. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. That's good, that. Oh, well done, mate. Okay, so right impression so far. I have noticed that they, uh, the engagement of the rear hub's like super, super, super quick, which is a real bonus compared to the old wheels that come on there. Um, when I spoke to the guys at Marin back in August, they, they have actually changed the rear hub now to a Shimano one, so it's going to be a quicker engagement if you buy a Marin, which is quite good to know. But yeah, I've uh, definitely noticed that straight away. I don't know if I mentioned, but I'm also running an insert in the rear uh, from uh, Rockstop. So I'm trying that out as well today, which is a bit, bit of an eye opener because I used to run Kush Kushcore many years ago and they were awesome. So um, loads of support in the corners, feels really good. The wheels don't feel like they're flexing at all. I will have to check the spokes after a ride because it's been ridden, it'll probably detention slightly, but that's all good. Um, something I am really impressed about is these aren't stickers, they're actually etched onto the rims Which is really 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 cool So yeah, we're gonna just drop in do some more riding, but first impressions on the wheels awesome loving them Let's go hit some more trials. Let's go <sighs> 
This is sweetness. Can't remember what this one's like. I guess it's going to be sweet. <laughs> oh, in fact, it's definitely got. Oh, they're rolly corners. Oh, that's nice. That was cool. That one, that was good. Oh, cheating line. Do a straight line now. Oh, nice. That sweetness was well good. Shame the GoPro went off on the way through. But yeah. Weirdly enough, I don't remember doing that before. Last time I was here. Oh no, because I've done blue. I've done some of the blue and the red. We didn't come this far. Right, down that way. Gloomy wood. This one's good. We'll get our breaking points right. They're nice. Yeah. Into the woods. Yeah, it picks out, didn't it? It's sucking and diving now. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Straight in. Cornering so good. Yeah. <sighs> oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 Right, we've had a long enough break. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this one, not so pointless. Well, there we have it, that's another ride done at Bedry Forest. Managed to catch up with Wayne this time, which was really good. Not ridden with him for a while, so he kept me in check, which was good. The GoPro run out, so hence why it just suddenly stops. But we're back now, and first impressions on the wheel set from Hope, the Falls 30s, no faults at all, absolutely faultless, really, really impressed with them. The rear hub engagement is insanely quick, especially coming from the stock Marin wheels that come on the bike. To switch over to Hope wheels and have that fast engagement is really noticeable when you go to put the power down, so I'm super happy with that. Um, I mentioned the, the graphics, they're etched on, which is insane, really, really impressed with that. I thought they were stickers in the pictures, but when they turned up a bite tarp, and I managed to pull them out of the box to have a little nose. They were really impressed, and so was I, to be honest. So, yeah, awesome. The other thing I'm doing as well is I'm running a rock stop insert in the rear. I previously run Kushkor front and rear and could really, really tell the difference instantly when riding on those. So, I haven't really got an impression just yet. It does feel like there's a bit more support there, but I think I need to do a bit more riding time. So, we'll do that. And as you can see, the bike's pretty clean. I haven't got to clean the bike today, which is amazing. Well, there we go. That's a little ride impression of the Hope Force 30s. And I'm going to do some more stuff as well with them, um, test them out on some downhill trails as well as just traily stuff, really put them to the test. But I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, give us a thumbs up. Really appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed already, then please do jump on board. Really appreciate that as well. I've got some, some fun events and some fun riding coming up. It's going to be pretty good. So watch this space. But until next time, stay awesome out there. See you on the hill. Peace.